if I would have settled my lawsuit, right, when the serpent, the devil, or the evil spirit came into my Garden of Eden, right, if I would have settled the case, how would my great-great-grandchildren receive their inheritance? If the, if the Bible says that my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, and I left money as an inheritance because I wasn't a seeker of knowledge, right? See, because once I had armed myself with my truth, right, then why would I fear anything if I was in court? See, I'm saying out here in the world, there's nothing I can do to defend myself from somebody who want to do something to me because they got all of this cover in the world, right? But see, when I read the Bible and it was talking about you have to bring them through a narrow gate, I saw that as the Silver Courthouse in Seminole County on October 4th in 2007. I brought the wealthy through that narrow gate. Now, once I started drawing them in, right, I started drawing my people away. See, I kept saying, hey, man, get your money out the banks because I got the banks coming through the eye of that needle, you see? But they can read about the Bible, but they can't see it fulfilling itself, right? I'm saying, well, don't you see? They, they would check. They, they came after my wealth. If you look at it from the 99, you all was right there where they wanted y'all to be. But once I started moving away and started being a shepherd, see, then they saw me feeding the sheep. See what I'm saying? So now they see me as a wolf in sheep's clothing. See, that, but you all not looking at it from the devil telling the story. But now I'm telling y'all, I'm saying, well, okay, well, if, if I am the one, right, and, and you are the 99, then who are they? They got to be telling you that I'm the one, you need to come get me, but who are they? They got to be God in the scenario, because it's three sides. It's me who done elevated away from you, right? So they had to come tell my wife a lie, just like the serpent told Eve a lie. Now, Adam could have chose, where well, Adam chose to follow Eve, but Eve was deceived, see? But what I did was I went to court to then um, show my Eve, which is my wife, Benita Elaine Epps Castle, the deception. See, I'm saying, hey, babe, you was beguiled, but I'm the judge. See what I'm saying? See, so... I had to go in the court to take the power away from the person who you think had power. Now, that's what Adam should have done, right? Now, if Adam would have did that, then Cain wouldn't have killed Abel because Adam would have been just as pleased with Cain's offering as he was with Abel's offering because they would have both been his sons offering him something. See, but how about if one not his son and one is, then wouldn't the jealousy come from the one that's not his son? See, that would be the resentful one. See, but in my God of Eden, I had a female image first. My daughter's six years older than my son. So I had learned how to cultivate love because I had a daughter, so I, I, had, I couldn't treat her like a boy. She wasn't my male image. She was a female's image. So my mother told me what to tell her as her father. And I had to tell her about my mother, which gave us a bond, a relationship. See, now my son, it was Rocky because that's my image and I have to mold him in my image because he got to take over my Garden of Eden. So that's what I'm saying, right? If I didn't defeat my devil, 
then wouldn't my gross injustice, which is the same as iniquity defined, well, wouldn't that have passed on to my son and my daughter? Because then they would have settled too. See, because if I settle, then they settle. But if I'm showing them that if you write what you settling for, if the person wrong, look what they took from you. So if they did it first, then you you just countering what they did to you. Say, well, okay, you took my house, you took my $1.2 million, you took my job, you took my company. So now when that wave come back on you, well, how you want to save something? See, like, how can your illusional wave take my house, my wife, my children? Because, see, you took their understanding, and then my wife started not believing in me. See, she, she loved me, but she lost belief because she didn't understand. See, she told me that. So now... Should I then not teach her or should I let you make her think that I didn't know what I was doing? And that's what I'm telling my friend. I'm saying, hold up, man, you in my house. See, I, I was trying to help do business with you, but now you in my house, man. It's like you the serpent now because you talking to my wife. And I'm saying, well, why are you talking to my wife about my business i'm saying brother that's my lady that's between me and her and her and i that has nothing to do with you but this business right here i'm saying look i need your expertise in that i don't need you in my personal business see that's what i'm saying because okay if i was to allow any of my friends into my personal business then my lady, whenever we have a problem, going to go get that friend. And then eventually me and that friend, that friend and I going to fall out. Because I'm going to be like, hey, man, what the hell? You know, why you keep on? See, so I I nip that in the bud off rip. See, that was, hey, man, my personal business. I don't, I don't be in your personal business. I ain't never came to you talking to you about your lady. So why are you talking to me about my lady? Like when we start being like that. See what I'm saying? So that's what I'm saying. See, if you don't start something, it ain't started. It done ended before it started. But see, if you, oh, man, you right. Oh, man, see, now he feel like he, he got that in. And you say, hey, bro, hey, about my business, uh -uh. personal? Nah, man, because I don't need my lady talking to you and confiding in you about our business. You ain't no counselor. I'm her counselor. She got a problem, you come talk to me. Because I'm the one going to say yeah or nay. And if I got a problem with you, I'm going to go to you. Because you the one going to say, tell me, I ain't, I ain't going to do that. Or tell me, I'm going to do that. And okay, but then now if you say you're going to do it, then then why you ain't doing it? If I say I'm going to do it, okay, I, I got your point. But why would a friend be able to come in there and worry how, how I'm going to listen to him? I'm saying, bro, you don't even know my business. You don't even know what's going on. How am I listening to you tell me about my business and you don't even know what's happening? So what is your advice based on what you believe? See, so that's what I'm saying. Hey, man, that's what you believe. But I'm doing what I know I got to do because I'm doing it. But now. Here, a man don't want to take in consideration the whole thing, right? He want to take bits and pieces out and tell me what to do. And I'm saying, but what about the elephant in the room? You don't know about the elephant? And then, oh, I don't know nothing about that. I'm saying, well, how can you counsel me if you don't know what's going on? How can you counsel me on what you think you know? And I'm supposed to sit there and listen to you when I know you don't know what you talking about. So I'm saying, well, look, bro, but look at this right here and then counsel me. But don't say, well, I don't want to see this. I'm saying, so you want to see half the picture and I got to see the whole picture because I'm going through the whole picture. But you just want to help me with my lady. I'm saying, well, I'm protecting my family, right, from this person right here 
and this entity right here and this entity right here but you saying well man now you need to concentrate on your lady and i'm saying well what about these entities here that then stole our house and took 1.2 million dollars then put planted down in my lady vine well how am i supposed to grow something that's broken see once your lady don't believe in you then how can you grow belief that's gone See, but I guess the person who don't understand that is the person who giving you um, advice. But you saying, brother, my lady ain't never seen me weak. She ain't never seen me broken because I ain't never been broken. I don't know what you talking about. See, because I'm always learning how to defend what I do because I understand the system that I'm living in. So if you are not legal, when you do something, then you are vulnerable to what you did.